Welcome back to Out of Controllers. We're gonna go through this door. That you've been through there. Nice going. Oh fuck. <laughs> no, it was green. Yes, because you oh. cleared the puzzle. Oh. <laughs> A slow clap on your body. Okay, time to go see what this thing is. Yes, that's very important. Famous jewel thief remains behind bars. Why is that Dick dudes? Chamberlain, a.k.a. Dirk. Dick... Dirk. Dirk Chamberlain, <laughs> a.k.a. Dirk the Smirk, was up for parole last week after having s served 20 years. I, this is very small text. That is rocking us over in order to get closer to the computer. <laughs> Alright, I've been served 20 years at Hargate Prison for a botched heights at, L at London's British Museum. His telltale MO, including ransoming the jewel back to the owner of and his use of black filament rope, convicted him of that crime. His defense says Chamberlain is now a reformed and elderly man. He expressed a desire to go live with one of his daughters. However, British opinion towards the French mastermind was unfavorable. Parole was denied. So what we're learning here is that Dirk Strider is a thief. From the general advertiser. Yes. Or, or the or, the general or no. To hit close. To get out of this get before get he tries to read it. Had big damn it. Hit space. Bar. I'm trying to make this game enjoyable. <laughs> I can't reach space bar because Dan's in the way. <laughs> I'm sorry, my body is huge and you can never. Okay. Me. Okay. So which door should I go through? Um, Did you look through all the evidence, maybe? Yeah. It's May and the trash basket. Well, you can't go outside. And also, why would outside. a French person be named Dirk? That's a very American name. Hush. Don't question the logic. <laughs> Dirk Chamberlain. <laughs> anyway, which one do we want to go Well, the, the one on the top goes outside and you can't go there yet, so you want to go to the one on the left. Okay. Loading the level. Time, Time traps. traps. Shit. You have 30 seconds. And, like, text will appear near where it is. Uh, radiators are a good spot for them, so they're, they're usually by the wall. No, it's on the floor. It's gonna be on the floor. There you go. Okay. Oh, good. You and were not killed by the radiator. You do lose a life if you don't disarm it, but it's not, like, an instant death thing. This game, like, what I like about this game is it has the puzzles, which makes it interesting, but it's not only about the puzzles, so, like, you can actually enjoy the, the gameplay experience. Oh, shit. There's two there. Yes, there are. I thought you were good at Minesweeper Rare Poses. Wow. <laughs> Someone is a puzzle expert. I am, um, used to numbers. Mm -hmm. The colors... Green is one, See all these numbers yellow is two. No, I know. Here. I'm just like, it's not my automatic, like. I know. Trust me. As someone with kind of color deficiency, this game was very hard. <laughs> also, as someone who has never played Minesweeper before and thus does not understand the game. Yeah, that was also pretty difficult. Both those things <laughs> worked against me very well. <laughs> this game was the most entertaining when I play it because I just die. It. Yeah, and in really, like, stupid and inept ways, it's great. Why is it Dan playing then? Because he already knows the plot. Oh. Yeah, we can't just have Mariposa reading lines like I would be doing, <laughs> and I would fail the game, and Mariposa would still be surprised by the reveal. I mean, I could play the game if that's what we wanted. No, it's okay. I'm just gonna have to do this. Ah, oh, shit. Wow, yeah. you died. You're huh. distracting me! Oh no, Mariposa can't handle commentary with the game. Goodness. You love us. You think you're my child. I regret every day <laughs> that I am your child. Oh. Yeah, that's what you probably should do. Oh, there's somebody in the corner. Yeah, I know. But you can't talk to them until you've disarmed all the Honestly, traps. I'm gonna let you in on a secret. That is a dude, um, and he's Australian. But I always see a little old woman doing like needlepoint. Yeah. To I've be heard, honest, I still see that, even though I don't know what you meant. Oh hey, you got Beauty 16 dirty. out of 16 traps, kiddo. Anyway, do you want to listen bizarre. to the voices from the vent. The voice is you... telling me. Mark my words, Juliet. Someday I'll find Smithers and kill him for running off and leaving me to do the butlerin'. 
and with all these guests hanging about, if I had my way, they'd all be dumped to the sea and left to swim to the mainland. You would have run away too if you had heard that horrible scream. I'm sick of hearing about that horrible scream. Gives me the creeps, it does. There was a scream. You can ask Lady Vandernot or Philippa. If you mean the old cow, she's not Lady Vandernot no more, is she? It's plain old Mrs. Vandernot now, and you can bet she's having a fit about it. Anyway, she doesn't care about how North died. All she cares about is hating that American twit who's scheming to get her hands on the estate. Poor North. It was so horrible, and I have the feeling it's not over yet. Oh, shut it. You'll have everyone on pins and needles, and this job is hard enough as it is. I'm going out to forget some weed. Later. <laughs> I mean. <laughs> ah. <coughs> anyway, shall we talk about this dude? Sure. I can't. I used to be really good at accents, and um, then I stopped speaking English um, consistently for a year, and now I'm really bad at them. That would do it, so. Well, I might have thing. a word, sir. Who the devil are you? <laughs> He's just gonna be Australian. The devil has nothing to do with it, sir. I'm Chief Inspector Parker of Scotland Yard, and I only just arrived. You can't prove my connection <laughs> to that cult in London. <laughs> Chief Inspector, are you? Oh fuck! Good day, mate. Are, are you on the business, or were you? A, are you here on business, or were you a friend of? I can't fuck this. Fuck, fuck accents. Okay. Uh, were you a friend of North's? Chief I mean, I'll find it. Are you here on business? Very much business, I'm afraid. I, I hope this is about all the bloody traps. A champ can hardly take a step in this house. There you go. There we go, found it. You did. At last, I was beginning to think I was imagining things. Maybe the boys down the yard were right, <laughs> and I am losing it. There starts to be a lot of contextual evidence for a lot of bullshit that we come up with. That or everybody around here is just gaslighting you. I've been running into that all day. <laughs> They think just because I'm an Australian, they can pull one over on me. Shit. And because I'm not very bright either. <laughs> they think I'm all looks. Not unless you were in the same nightmare. Edmund Dashalot at your service. Came for the funeral. So what are you going to do about this trap business then? I'm going to find all. And I'm going to have a great time. <laughs> oh yes, the booby traps. Oh, that's not fair. I'm hoping, I'm hoping some of them are also pairs of boobies. <laughs> Find the responsible party, Mr. Dashalot. To that end, I hope you will answer a few questions. Now, nah, fuck that, mate. I don't talk Fire to away. the popo. <laughs> North Van. Tell me how you knew North West. I mean, uh, North Van. <laughs> well, North. We were in the same profession, weren't we? Rogues, bushwhackers, riverbenders. Were you? Explorers. No, I'm, I mean we were gay. <laughs> I mean we fucked. I mean we fucked in Australia. <laughs> Adventurers. That's what the London Post called me. Suits me, don't you think? He sounds like a twelve-year-old. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. It also suited Lord Vanderbilt. I read a few articles of his uh, exploits <laughs> myself. Oh, gay too, are you? It's yeah. a racy magazine. <laughs> Did you ever go an adventure together? <laughs> well, Every day. I'm like old gay Englishman. <laughs> You'd be surprised. No, but like what rags I want to know about the times. <laughs> Only once. Still, he was a friend enough to come pay my respects. Is this okay? Since I'm like dominating areas again. <laughs> I'm just oh, continually oh. making Mariposa uncomfortable. Oh, to play this video no, game. I... <laughs> you guys had no idea what I was talking about. No! no. <laughs> I'm good at talking. What do you know about North's family? Uh, not, uh, apart from the fact that they're both famous. <laughs> <laughs> well, Cognier's pretty much a musical genius as far as I'm concerned. I ain't never said much about him. <laughs> Just that, uh, he, you know, you can't really be gay and have a good relationship with your family. It's just not possible. Also, I'm wondering, why did he say 300 like the Romans when it was the Spartans? Oh, I know so much about Kanye West. Yeah, you know a little, bit much, a little bit more about Kanye West, as in you know something about Kanye West? As opposed to the two of us who are like, that is a man, yes. I have heard this name before. 
Anyway. I'm going to let you finish. <laughs> okay, I know that because that's like a meme. But, okay. Uh, just, just that he was happy to get away from Raven Court because, you know, they were all homophobes. and Well, not all of them, but most of them. I think that's the reason he traveled like he did. From what I've heard of, seen of them this week, I can't blame him. That would be Philippa and Franklin Egerton, your step siblings, and Barbara Vandenot, his stepmother. No, that's, I mean, the traps. <laughs> <laughs> I think they've been here for years. <laughs> Mostly air, I think. She's a right witch, I can tell you. Oh, you mean bitch. Uh, yeah, well, you know, I was trying to be, you know, not as sexist about that, but yeah. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I'm old and white. Right, yeah. <laughs> no, it's, it's more PC to just call him a witch now. Anyway, um, uh, she's not exactly grieving over North. The other two, at least, seem genuinely sorry. Have you heard of any, um, any of them speak against me? To me? No. But then none of them have said more than two words to me since I got here. Yeah, said, like I said, I'm gay, and nobody no. seems to like right. appreciate that. We're Next. going to find out about me, Vandenot, and the booby trapper. Dun 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 dun. This time on Out of Control. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.